Wilkes County is a special place filled with wonderful people. The Health Foundation is on a mission to ensure that every person here is healthy, safe, and able to thrive. With your help, we're tackling complex problems that no single organization or program could possibly solve alone. One problem facing Wilkes County children and their parents is the need to overcome the chronic toxic effects of stress, like abuse, neglect, addiction, mental illness, and the times we're living in. Resiliency is important for everyone. It helps people stay well during times of stress. In 2015, the Health Foundation looked at adverse childhood experiences as an upstream approach to improving health outcomes of the people in Wilkes County. We first started out by sending a group of people to a conference, and at this conference, they learned about adverse childhood experiences and potential programs that we could bring to Wilkes County. Reconnect for Resilience is a curriculum that was created by a group out of Asheville with the support of the Health Foundation that was trained in that program. During this training, participants uh, received some tools that helped them understand how to shut off their stress response and activate their relaxation response. It's all about understanding the brain and the body's response to stress and trauma. What resilience tools do is they give us a chance to teach folks what those body sensations are telling them that they're coming from their nervous system only, and that it's perfectly normal and to be expected given the circumstances. In 2018, the Health Foundation sponsored 13 professionals to become resiliency educators. So collectively, this group of 13 professionals have completed 18 trainings in Wilkes County, reaching over 260 people. Reconnect for Resilience training that we've provided to educators has helped a teacher or a principal, anyone in the school, keep their brain online when they're getting upset by something that's happening. And when your brain's online, you can respond differently. You can make a choice rather than reacting. It is a curriculum that helps um, really anyone in the community, uh, but my focus has been hospital employees and people who are in healthcare to understand about um, trauma-informed care. The work that I do is loaded with vicarious trauma. And what that means is that when you hear these things that are really hard, uh, sometimes it's hard not to take that on yourself. And I use the reconnect tools to help me stay in my zone so that I can serve children, families, and our partners in the best way that I can. To me, that looks like we are taking a whole community focus um, because I think it's not just something we can do at, in schools that um, will build resiliency, but it's also got to be embedded in the community. And our work with the HELP Foundation has allowed us to work with other organizations to um, build that capacity and understanding. Because I think if we are more trauma-informed as a community, we respond to others differently and can be more empathetic and compassionate. I am filled with an amplified sense of grace and gratitude for all that you, our donors, and our partners are doing to contribute to a healthier community. Learn more about how you can become a member at www.healthywilks.org. And thank you, thank you for contributing to a healthier Wilkes County.